New Year's Eve in Mexico City and the streets are busy. This should be the busiest night of the year for bars and nightclubs, but with red alert pandemic protocols in place in the capital's main nightlife district, the doors are shuttered. And as January looms, economic casualties are expected to rise. Mexico's Association of Bars and Nightlife Businesses is warning that as a result of the forced closures during the pandemic, nearly 6,000 establishments may close for good come January, an economic downturn that will leave some 350,000 people without work. Cristian de la Torre is the owner of Café Taco Bar, one of the capital's most highly awarded cocktail bars. He says the uncertainty is devastating. With each passing day that you can't open, you feel worse because you don't know if you'll ever reopen the business you started with your life savings or what you might do if it fails. I think I can survive for one more month, but then we don't know when the red alert will change or what the protocols will look like when it does. It's a coin flip. We really don't know anything. Yet the nightlife lockdown hasn't deterred the partygoers. Tourists and locals alike are finding ways to ensure they keep the party going. I mean, it's Mexico, you know, you can still go out and like do stuff. It's, obviously, it's probably not the safest thing, but I mean, that's what we're doing. Because <laughs> like, for example, right now, supposedly is La Ley Seca, so they're not selling any alcohol, but like they are selling alcohol. So. Am I snitching right now? Elkin Aguilar is the president of the Mexican Association of Bars, Clubs and Nightclubs. He says while the business sector has been given no hint of when things may be allowed to reopen, the authorities have done nothing about the clandestine side. What has proliferated is black market nightlife. Bars and discos popping up for a single night in warehouses or abandoned homes without any sort of safety protocols. The authorities have been unable to control them, and it's these clandestine events have resulted in far greater infection rates when it comes to COVID. Mexico City will review its COVID-19 restrictions on January 10th. Whether the country's bars are still operating when the date arrives remains to be seen. Alastair Babastock, CGTN. Mexico City.